Hello friends, welcome to my channel Triad Studio. In this video, I am going to show you how to stream on multiple platforms using OBS, and it is absolutely free of cost. All you need is a better internet speed because with dual platform stream now you will require double upload bandwidth. Actually, you can stream on several platforms, not only on dual platforms. You can stream simultaneously on Twitch, YouTube, and on Facebook. Let's see how we can do this. To configure OBS for multiple streaming, at first we have to install a plugin. So let's download multiple RTMP output plugin. First, click here to go to the download page, and from this page, click on OBS multiple RTMP portable zip file to download it. I will provide the download link in the description, so don't worry. You can check the link from there. Once download is complete, open the zip file and copy the contents inside C drive where OBS is installed. So I am going to copy this in clipboard and then I am going to open C drive then program files and here search for OBS studio it's here so let me open it and paste the contents here now select this do this for all files and click on continue so our plugin has been pasted here now let's open OBS to configure multiple streaming after opening OBS you will see a new dock at the left hand side and we can move this dock so I am going to drag it to the right side so that I can fix it with the OBS interface now we have to configure settings uh, under OBS settings we can configure one platform and within this dock we can configure another platform inside OBS I have Facebook live streaming setup so here at first I'm going to advanced settings and then I have to select the encoder let's set it to Nvidia and then rescale it because Facebook still supports up to 720p so I'm going to select here 720 and the bitrate should be 3000 megabyte per second uh, as this is uh, 720p I think uh, processor encoding will be better so let's set it to processor and then I'm going to click apply then under video settings uh, I am going to set it to 720p and here 36 samples now we are set for Facebook live now click on ok now under this doc click on add a new target and here I'm going to rename it to YouTube YouTube and then here we have to copy paste youtube server address so i am going to open my youtube streaming page and from here i have to copy this url now paste it here and here i have to paste my stream key so again this is my stream key copy it then paste it here okay don't try to use it i will change it later and you can leave everything as it is this way uh, this docket will take the obs settings but i want to change it i want to set it to nvidia uh, because i want to utilize my all resources together because if i set this to default it will take my previous settings for facebook live and all the load will be on the processor but i want to set the load to nvidia graphics card and select this start with obs this way when i click here start streaming both the platform will start streaming simultaneously so everything is set now let's test uh, streaming whether this is working or not so this is under facebook streaming and right now i am going to streaming my desktop not a game i am just streaming my desktop and here you can see broadcasting message and cpu usage is showing here now let's check uh, Facebook and YouTube whether they are receiving broadcasting signal and here Facebook is receiving signal if I click on start test as this is a test stream and now my test stream is live on Facebook now let's check YouTube and here YouTube is also receiving signal so both the platforms are streaming simultaneously using OBS this is a great feature and also you can add another platform like Twitch by clicking on the docket add new target for Twitch you have to use your username and password as Twitch does not support stream key and here for Facebook streaming my CPU usage is 15% and now let's check Ethernet usage 
and ethernet usage is nearly 7.55 megabyte per second i have set to 3000 and 4000 so total 7 megabyte per second and my gpu usage is nearly 30 to 40 percent for youtube streaming because youtube streaming is being done with 1080p so this is it i hope you find this video helpful thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel for more videos like this if you have any doubt and question feel free to ask in the comment section i will try my best to reply you have a great day. Ta-da.